Well, what's up guys, x Kiwis here, and welcome back to possibly the last episode of The Road to Glory. Um, the first half of this episode is going to be me talking about this uh, series and where it's going and how it might be ending, and showing you through the uh, teams that I've used for the SBCs I'm going to complete for the pack opening, and then after that, of course, opening the packs. Before we get into that, if you could, of course, leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already, then that would be much appreciated. So, as you can see, I've got four packs in the store at the minute, but I've completed the marquee matchups, the cultural SBC, and one of the League of Nations SBCs. Not sure which one it is, but we'll have a good pack, a uh, good amount of packs, and good packs to complete as well. But as you can see, I've also uh, sold my team on the transfer list to gain coins for the um, SBCs that I was completing. But um, yeah. Talk about the series as we go through these. I don't, I don't think there's any point in keeping it going. To be honest, um, look, I haven't got the want to grind another series. I'm currently grinding my main account as the team on there is nowhere near as good as it should be, and I've got a steady amount of coins, but nothing good. And I want to have a good team on that account to play with, and I can't. I just don't want. I don't have the want to play this game enough to grind on two accounts. I don't have the want to grind enough on one account, to be honest, as this game is hard work. It is massively hard work. A lot of you have been agreeing with me in the comments section. Um, this series wasn't getting great views either, to be honest. No one was really interested in it. And I'd much rather, well, from next year, uh, FIFA 19, I'm just going to plain start out with a road to glory. So every single video that I do uh, on A Road to Glory will be my main channel. So that'll just be everything. I don't want to spend money on this game. So I'm not uh, on FIFA 19, that is A Road to Glory. And I'll probably put my second account as a draft to glory or something. Which I think could work a lot better last year. But um, yeah, as I was saying, it's not getting good views. So you guys obviously don't really want to watch it. I don't really want to play on this account, to be honest. There's no point. It's just no one as i say my main account's got nowhere near as good enough players so if i'm gonna grind anything i'd rather it be that one so i thought why not come on here complete some svcs for the last um video on it and just have a bit of fun open a few good packs and then just mess around with the coins afterwards maybe not sure what i'm gonna do with the coins they might just sit there for a while until maybe some other svcs come out so i can do another pack opening I might do a few pack openings on here if I've got the coins. Because I'm still going to have the account. I'm just not going to play on it. Ah, however, I do need to go and get two players. So I will be right back. So as I was talking about, I'm not going to lie, I forgot what I was talking about. I think I was saying about my um, second account and what I can do with that. I might just leave the coins on there and mess around with um, doing some packs and more SBCs when they come out. Because I will still have the account, of course. So, yeah, if SBCs or promos or that come out, I'm just waste coins on them and still give a few pack openings for my channel. But um, as we complete this last SBC, we get a rare players pack and 5k coins for that. So, um, let's go and get into the packs. I thought, what better way to end it than on a nice little pack opening? And um, we've actually got 18 packs in store, which is a nice amount. And as you can see, they're all pretty good packs. So, uh, yeah, let's get, get into them and start on the um, first one. It's only a gold pack, so not going to be a lot in here. Marquee matchups, I would definitely uh, recommend doing this week. Last week, they were poor, to be fair. I had a look at them. I always complete them on my main account, but I looked at them for last week, and the packs were shocking. But uh, four out of the five packs this week were actually really good, so I would highly recommend doing that. Uh, um, oh, we get a flare and a premium gold pack. That's a shock. Can we get anybody good? French, CDM. Ah, it's only Snyderling. Was hoping for a Kante, who's of course been upgraded. Would have been a nice pull. But my luck on my, uh, luck on my May account's been pretty good recently, which is a very big shock. And on the road to glory, it's been pretty good altogether. So, could be a recipe for a good pack opening here. No flare there, I'm just going to skip it if it's no flare. And again, I forgot what I was talking about a minute ago. So, I'll just carry on with these packs. Uh, just discard the Stadium of Light and get into the next Jumbo Premium Gold Pack. Oh, I was gonna, I was talking about the uh, marquee matchups. I was gonna say I can't remember if I have or not already in this video, but I do use Footbin for all of the SBCs that I go and complete. 
they show the cheapest way to do it and it's just really easy and a quick way to do it also tells you if you need loyalty for them or not um i think i only used one of these that actually needed loyalty which can waste a little bit of time but it's definitely worth it you can save a lot of coins by just doing a loyalty glitch and of course you don't get a loss on your record uh, that's something else we could talk about here as well my record does look very nice on this account i'm quite happy with where uh, finished off the actual record only one loss which was in foot champs where i finished like nine and one i think was the only loss that i took of course we're 12 and i'm on draft i'm beaten on that um i think i played one or two divisions games to be honest played a few squad battles so um yeah finishing with only one loss on the record is pretty good in my eyes as we open premium gold players pack so these packs from here are all 25k packs or more so i'd expect a few good uh packs here to be honest no flare in that one though pizzy's going for a little bit i think so is fernandez i'll use that fernandez in a couple of sbcs we'll chuck these players up to the trade list uh transfer list and then sell them on as we get into the next 25k pack can we get anybody good from here can we get a flare no flare again i'm not a fan of these uh premium gold players packs if you don't already know we get a transfer storage of course there is the uh, transferred premiership and uh, not the transferred well transferred players as well but the um upgraded players for the i think it's the premiership calcio a and league of one players out at the minute that have been upgraded so hopefully we can pull a good few players of that as we get absolutely nothing in that pack i might look at doing some, i've got a few um rare players in the club as well so might have a look at completing some of them upgrade packs and doing a video on them i've already got some stored on my main channel but if i can do some more on this pack everyone likes seeing upgrade packs they usually do really well for views on my channel so i like doing them quite a lot oh gray's been upgraded didn't realize that this db's going for a little bit 1.3 i think because i bought him earlier for an sbc uve fourth kit huh greedy having fourth kits so opened 10 packs and got one flare so far and that was only from a premium gold pack so not the best so far what do i want to open next we'll stick with these mega packs we have two 50k packs in here which isn't bad to be fair can we get a flare no flare again come on man give me a bit of luck it's like they know i'm ending it surely they want me to end it on a high so i keep playing on it uh, nobody good there send them all into the club two 50k packs two 55k packs i think they are and uh, three 45k packs so let's get into these ones next come on give me somebody good give me a flare are you kidding me man come on give a guy a break munier 81 is the best player send abraham up to the transfer list as we get into the next prime gold players pack come on this has been awful 12 packs open so far and one flare 13 packs opened good packs opened as well like 11 of the 13 packs have been very decent packs and we've got one flare that wasn't even from one of the decent packs come on man sort yourselves out ea give me some ink last prime gold players pack surely we get a flare in this one inform special card somebody right there's no inform no special card but it is a flare can we get somebody good portugal well it's not going to be left wing is it Who's that? Pereira? It is Pereira. So we get an 83 and we get a board, but a shocker again, let's be fair. Ruiz in there for about the 10th time that I've packed him. Uh, Garcia send up to the transfer list. And we get four packs left. I mean, they are four very good packs, but the other packs are good as well, and I've been shafted on them. But come on, give me a special card or something. Uh, Man of the matches are out of packs now, I'm pretty sure. We do get a flare, though, it's no inform. Can it be somebody big though? Portuguese again, CDM again, is that Pereira again? It is Pereira again. Oh, I mean, it's an 83 again, but it's shocking, man. From a 55k pack, 82, Gabbiadini. He looks like he's an upgraded card, but he's never going to sell for anything. Send Pereira up to the transfer list, and this is disappointing. Oh, come on. Losing all motivation after this pack opening. Give me somebody big. Lift my spirits again. Right, no, we get a flare. No board, uh, no inform, I mean. Somebody good? Portuguese? You are kidding me. Well, Bernardo Silva, which is an 84, which is better than nothing. This Portuguese flag is just horrible to see, because you know it's never going to be Ronaldo. Never, ever going to be Ronaldo. So, 
There's just nobody other good than that to pack. I actually haven't packed Pepe once this year. Even that look, we get another CDM Portuguese. It's an 83 rated. So three and three packs. Come on. We have a few squad fitnesses in that little cell in there. But other than that, again, nothing good. We'll just oh, send them up to the transfer list. Didn't mean to. So we've got two 50k packs left. Come on, give me something big out of one of these two. Come on, give me an inform. We get a flare. We don't think it's an inform. No, it's not. Can we get anybody good though? Polish, be striker. Of course, it's centre back. I mean, an 85 isn't bad, to be honest. That's at least like 12. Well, it's at least 10k, but I think they're about 12k at the minute, which isn't bad. We get a transfer to Rude that I'm guessing goes for nothing. We get a couple of 83s in there. That's, that's not a bad pack. I mean, of course, for 50k, it's not good, but it's not bad. Oh, he is below 10k at the minute, actually. But 10k is better than nothing. Howard Ed's impairing ourselves for like 2k each. Giroud, I'm not sure how much he sells for. But we send them up to the transfer list. Can we pack somebody good in our last pack? How many A? Be kind. Give me, well, give me a flair to start with. But give me an inform. There's a lot of good informs in packs at the minute. Oh, there's no inform. It is a flair, though. Can we get anybody good to end off? Germany, left wing, Draxler. No, we can't. 84 rated, so he'll sell again, but... All, all of the packs are open there. Like 16 of them. Well, I suppose we get an upgrade in Marquinhos as well. His 83 was going for a little bit. Oh, his 84 is pretty much going for the same price as his 83 was. Of course it is. Oh, as I was saying, 16 of these 18 packs I've just opened are very decent packs. And we got shafted. Let's, let's not get it wrong. I've opened all them SBC packs on my main account and got better than uh, a lot better than that. They're usually really good to me, the um, advanced SVCs, but today we got shafted. But um, yeah, that's going to be the end of the video. If you could, of course, leave a like. Comment down below what you think about this series and the ending and that. If you've got any other recommendations for me to do anything on it, then that would be great. And of course, subscribe if you haven't already would be very much appreciated. So that's going to be the end of the video for me, guys. Thanks for watching.